Hey, buddies, Potato McWhiskey here, and welcome to uh, let's do a channel update video, basically. Um, so you might know, you can kind of see my face here. That's me. Hi, how's it going? We uh, kind of had planned to do like a face reveal stream on July the 12th, which was my birthday. Um, I got an ear infection, so that didn't work out. So I'm kind of live on Twitch now, screwing around with my fans, kind of testing out my setup, the green screen, the, um, the webcam, all that sort of stuff. But what we're going to be doing is on Friday, the 26th of July, we'll be doing a proper, like, happy birthday potato. Here is your um, live stream. Also, I'm really bright and shiny because it's really sunny outside and I have a window right in front of me. So I just look like <laughs> ridiculously shiny. I, I Believe me, I'm not that shiny in person. I'm much more pink in person. Um, but yeah, so uh, Friday, the 26th of July, we will be doing a happy birthday face reveal stream, even though technically I have already revealed my face. I was kind of tempted to just put like a thumbnail with like, you know, the outline of me and then like a question mark is like, who is Potato? Come on Friday the 26th. But I was just like, nah, you know what? I'm going to show you guys because you guys have been waiting a long time and people have been asking forever. So hello, this is me. We'll be doing more of this. I don't know if I'm going to do, put my face in my YouTube videos, but definitely for live streams because it's kind of just the way that live streams are done. Um... So we're going to talk about a couple of things. So that was the face reveal and the birthday stream. We're also going to talk just a quick minute about the direction of the YouTube channel. So uh, a couple of you have probably already noticed that we're doing um, less raw Let's Play content and less videos overall. And that's intentional. There's going to be less videos on the channel and there's going to be more high quality videos. They're going to be longer. They're going to be edited. And I'm hopefully as I get better at editing, the quality of the editing is going to go up. And there's going to be more stuff like um, opinion videos, live stream cuts, uh, for example, like funny highlights from the live stream might make it in to a video on YouTube. That sort of stuff. We're going to be doing a l just, just generally less videos overall, but my intention is to increase the quality of those videos to where it feels like you're getting a better deal when you're subscribed to my channel. Uh, with regards to so that's that's basically that's the new direction we're going to be doing more edited videos i i may in the future if i decide to i might go back to uh unedited unedited let's play videos that might be a thing that we do for live streams and live stream schedules and plans for twitch what we're going to be doing is right now the tentative plan is to have three guaranteed days for live streams so that is monday tuesdays and thursdays from noon british standard time to 6 p.m british standard time so what that means is uh i could start earlier and i could go later but those six hours are when i am definitely going to be streaming um so that you can kind of like you know maybe you're in work or you're whatever and you're like oh i know potato is streaming i'm just gonna have it on in the background or whatever I will be doing a lot more stream content in general. We will be doing more bonus streams, more streams on the weekend, more streams. You know, if I just, you know, I don't know, eat bad cheese and can't sleep, we'll stream. We'll be doing a lot of streams on Twitch over on twitch.tv forward slash potato McWhiskey. Go check that out. There's links in the comments, all that stuff. We'll be doing a lot more live content. Um, I also want to talk about sponsorships, ethics, and like making money on YouTube and on Twitch. So... I'm, my YouTube channel is now at a point where I am sort of making a wage. I am making, you know, this is a job. This is a viable job that, you know, it's, I would, I would equate it to being like a, I don't know, like, like a factory worker, right? It's not, I'm not, I'm not living a glamorous lifestyle, but I can make enough money to pay bills and, you know, buy things. That is the definition of a job, in my opinion, is where you make money and you can pay bills and you can buy things. Uh, that's why. <laughs> okay, anyway. So what does that matter? That matters because I'm starting to get approached for things like sponsorships, like play our game and we will pay you. Or, for example, promote our product and we will pay you. Uh, could you show your mo this mobile game to your audience, right? So... Um, before I really wanted to engage heavily with like sponsorships and ad deals and brand deals, all that sort of stuff. Um, I wanted to make sure that I had like an ethical guiding principle because I feel like a lot of content creators don't have like an ethical guiding principle with regards to that kind of stuff. So I'm going to do my best to lay it out. This isn't going to be the rules forever, but it's kind of like the place that I'm operating from that we will sort of start out doing these kind of sponsorship deals. 
So I will be doing sponsorship deals and I will only accept sponsorship deals that I think are ethical, i.e. I don't think they cause harm to my audience. So for example, if there was a mobile game that asked me to promote it and it relied heavily on microtransactions and exploitative gameplay and all these sorts of things to get people addictive and get them spending like ridiculous amounts of money, I would not accept that deal. Um, B, they are relevant to my audience and me. So for example, uh, a 4X game, if a, if a person came to me with a 4X game, I would be much more likely to accept that deal. And they said, I want you to make a video about our 4X game. Um, I would be like, yeah, sure. Whereas for example, if somebody came to me with like a deal for um, razors, like Harry's razors or maybe Curiosity Stream or some other thing like that, I would be like, no, I'm, I'm not gonna do that because it's not really relevant to my audience and what we do and what we're about. This isn't why people watch my videos. And the third one is if it's something that I personally use already. So for example, if Audible asked me to be sponsored by them, I would say yes, because I listen to Audible all of the time. It is a product that I 100% wholeheartedly endorse. So that is the sort of three, um, the three ethical sort of guiding, I don't even know, those are like the three guiding principles of how I do, how I'm going to be doing sponsorship deals if I do them at all. Um, because I just want to speak as a viewer of YouTube videos. There is nothing more annoying than like getting into a really good Hearts of Iron video or a really good Civilization video or like this is really good edited compilation and they get like two minutes in and then stop to promote some fucking dog shit dragon MMO mobile game that has absolutely no relevance to me and it just makes me angry as a viewer and I just really want to close those videos and stop watching. So that sort of shit will not be happening because I fucking personally hate that when I'm watching videos. So we won't be doing any of that. Anyway, rant over, right? Paradox Con. I will be going to Paradox Con. It is in October in Berlin on the 18th of October to the 20th of October. You are... If you are going, you have full license to come bother me in person. I will endeavor to set up like a fan meetup uh, I'll have to like pick a location where we're going to do that and I'll have to like pick a time and stuff like that. It's a couple of, it's a couple of, it's a few months out. So it's a little bit early to kind of make those kind of decisions, but it is something that we will do in the not too distant future. My neighbor has decided that it is time to start power washing his garden, which I really, really appreciate while I'm recording this video. Um, but yeah, that's all of the things. Uh, it is not a license to come like be like an asshole to me it is a license to come ask me questions or hang out or just have a chat with me you're more than welcome to at paradox con um but i would really really appreciate it if like i look like i'm stressed out or i've like just had too much go on that day uh bother me anyway and make me feel bad that i'm uh, short and an asshole to you. No, I'm just kidding. Just you, you full license to come bother me at that weekend. I will do my best to be as friendly and as sociable as possible, even if I don't feel like it, because people might want to see my face and get pictures. You put them on Instagram and you can get people to laugh at me publicly. All that sort of jazz. You know, it'll be great fun. Anyway, that's it for me for this update video. I hope you guys uh, come join us on the live streams. I hope you guys are having fun with the new videos on YouTube. I hope you guys are just generally having a really nice summer. As you can see from the light on my face, I am sweating my knackers off. And it is a rough day here in sunny Ireland. But anyway, yeah, I love you all very much. And I'll see you next time.